we're going to try using the stick method here, or the crisscross method, I should say. We want two numbers that multiply to four. Well, probably we're going to try two and two. We, use, we could try four and one, but we'll try two and two for now. We usually like to try the options that are closest together. And we want two numbers that multiply to positive 15. Well, right away we think five and three. But notice that they have to add to a negative. We need a negative middle term. So we can have a negative five and a negative three. And that'll work because negative five times negative three is positive 15. But the summing of it will give us a negative number which we want. So we then try our crisscross. Two times negative three is negative six. Two times negative five is negative 10. Negative 10 plus negative six is negative 16. We got what we want. So what that means is we now ignore the crisscross and read straight across. 2x minus 5 is our first factor, 2x minus 3 is our second factor. And we kind of try to shove our rough work off to the side, and there's our solution.